Well, I've been reporting on a lot of bad news lately, and I got frustrated in the last video, and I had a couple people comment about the language in the video. I understand, and I try to keep things very professional on this channel, but I think we're at a, a point in this country where if we can't take a couple bad words, a couple adult words, then the wrong things bother us. So if, I hope that doesn't bother you, but if it does, like what, how are you gonna feel if this country gets to the point where we actually have to take it back? Because you're gonna hear a lot of bad words. I, I don't know, I, I apologize, but you know, as a, I'm almost 50 years old, sometimes I get excited and I just say what I say. But uh, let's try some good news, shall we? Iowa Governor Kim Reynolds on Friday signed House File 2464 into law. This new law is informally called the Second Amendment Privacy Act, and it, what it does is it protects the privacy and sensitive financial information of people purchasing firearms and ammunition in Iowa. And I think it's phenomenal. There are now a dozen states with laws that protect the Second Amendment financial privacy of citizens. It's amazing that we even have to do this, but thank you to those now dozen states. Got a quick favor to ask you guys. I did it in my last one. My birthday's coming up July 25th. I would love to hit 700,000 subscribers. If you could just do that, I'd appreciate it. Just hit subscribe on the channel, double check your subscriptions. That is a mark like I set five years ago and thought, you know, I'll, I'll never get to that, but, it, but that is a goal I set. And it's like that close. So if you could help me, I'd appreciate it. And maybe go over to Liberty, Liberty Lounge and subscribe to our podcast as well. That would be cool. Now, I want to thank the sponsor of this video, Sportsman's Guide. And I got some sales and some good news scattered in this as well. Uh, for everything you need to enjoy the fun, freedom, and traditions of the outdoors, you got to check out Sportsman's Guide. For hunting and fishing to camping and hiking and what we do for fun with tools, uh, they'll have us covered over at Sportsman's Guide. All Walkers Game Ear Pro is on sale until April 27th. And I'm going to give you my hack. Join the Buyers Club. I've been a member of the Buyers Club for years now. And get you get 10% off most of the items at uh, Sportsman's Guide. You also get 5% off ammo every single day, as well as free shipping once you hit $49. And on purchases of $150 or more, they let you break it up into four interest-free installments, making it easier and more affordable to buy new gear and, uh, you know, Freedom Seed dispensers. And if you use code, it's a weird code. I'll, I'll, I'll have it down below as well. Gun gag five G U N G A G five. You can save five percent on Hornady Freedom Seeds. Yeah, they sent me some to go play with. I can't wait. But you can use that code to save five percent on Hornady Hornady Freedom Seeds through May thirty first. So that's a big thing that they just offered my viewers. Thank you so much uh, to Sportsman's Guide. And you can still use my code Gadgets to save twenty dollars off the first hundred dollars you spend. So there's all kinds of ways to save over at Sportsman's Guide. So that's some pretty good news. All right, let's get back to this Iowa law. And this new law protects financial institutions from requiring the use of a firearm code. Remember those MCCs, the Merchant Category Codes we were talking about about a year and a half ago? Well, it prevents those from being assigned to firearms and ammunition purchases at retail when you use a credit card. The law also forebodes discrimination against Firearm retailers, as a result of the assigned or non-assigning of a firearm code and disclosing the protected financial information. So they're protecting the purchaser as well as the point of sale, the uh, FFL, which is pretty cool. Also, the law prohibits keeping or causing to be kept any list, any record, or any type of registry of a private firearm ownership uh, sale. So good on that as well. Now remember this idea of firearm retailer MCC codes, merchant category codes, was an idea of the anti-gun New York Times columnist Andrew Ross Sorkin and Amalgamated Bank. Now Amalgamated Bank, if you remember back then, I did a couple videos on this, they, uh, they lobbied the Swiss-based ISO, that's the International Organization for Standardization, uh, to create these codes, and they oversee all of the code codes, the merchant category codes for uh, for credit cards. Now, Iowa now joins Kentucky, Wyoming, Indiana, Utah, Florida, Idaho, Mississippi, Montana, North Dakota, Texas, and West Virginia as states that are standing up for the purchasing of the Second Amendment items. 
No longer will these states allow the invasion of financial privacy when people exercise their Second Amendment rights. And I think that is phenomenal. Again, it's a, it's, it's a sad state of affairs when you have to make laws like this because the government is looking to give it to you. I don't know about you guys and gals, but this country is spiraling to a point that I never foresaw. You also have now, he announced it yesterday, the speaker, the one who just gave away billions, billions of dollars to every other country but America, he just announced he's going to be going to Texas to stump for Tony Gonzalez, the rhino who voted for giving that money to those locations, who is also being challenged by Brandon Herrera. So you got a, the, the new uni party uh, speaker now stumping for a rhino. It's crazy uh, what's, what's happening in this country. And then you also have Donald Trump and everything he's going through just said that sending all that money overseas and not actually taking care of our border is a travesty. But then he said that he wants to keep Speaker Johnson. It's, uh, it's been crazy. Let me know what you guys and gals think about this one down below. Hopefully your state's in the process of passing a similar restriction on the banks looking to see what you have and where you have it. I'll see you all in the next one. Take care.